the U.S. Air Force is moving forward with plans to extend the life of its B-52H Stratofortress bombers with the Commercial Engine Replacement Program, CERP. The program will replace the current Pratt & Whitney made, decades-old TF-33 engines with new F-130 engines from Rolls-Royce and Boeing. The goal is to keep the Cold War-era bombers flying into the 2050s as the B-52J. According to Service Acquisition Chief Andrew Hunter, the U.S. Air Force expects to seek a Milestone B decision on the program in September. The completion of the Milestone B review will allow the SERP to begin engineering and manufacturing development as well as transition away from the middle tier of acquisition rapid prototyping effort under which it now operates. The SERP will not only replace the B-52's engines but also update the bomber's flight systems, cockpit throttles, and displays. Additionally, the program will modernize the B-52's radar, improving the bomber's situational awareness and ability to accurately strike targets. Communication upgrades will also enhance the B-52's ability to exchange data and collaborate with other Air Force aircraft or units to strike targets. The new commercial derivative engines will be able to use a broader supply chain than the current TF-33 engines, which frequently break and have problems with parts availability. Hunter said the program's digital prototyping work has done quite a bit of risk reduction on the program. Rolls-Royce is also testing the new F-130 engines at an outdoor test facility at NASA's Stennis Space Center in Mississippi, the company said in March. The B-52 is an iconic symbol of U.S. air power, and its longevity is a testament to the skill of its designers and the dedication of its maintenance crews. Lt. Gen. Richard Moore, the Air Force's Deputy Chief of Staff for Plans and Programs, said the B-52 would use its considerable payload capability to fire standoff munitions out of range of Chinese defenses in a potential war against China. However, the Air Force is not ruling out the possibility of a clean sheet designed to replace or add to the bomber fleet with something that could handle an emerging threat. The Air Force is also focusing on deciding how many B-21s it will end up buying, and is working on the next-generation air dominance fighter system, as well as next-generation refueling and mobility aircraft, Moore explained. The Air Force decided to dramatically accelerate acquisition of its next-generation aerial refueling system by about 15 years due to the increasing threat from China. In conclusion, the SERP program to put new engines on B-52H Stratofortress bombers is a vital step in extending the life of these iconic aircraft ensuring that they can continue to serve the U.S. Air Force well into the future. With a modernized flight system, upgraded radar, and improved communications, the B-52s will remain a critical element of U.S. air power, even in the face of emerging threats from China. Until next time, take care.